Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to some retro FIFA 16 squad builder showdown for the next six weeks. Every Monday evening, we are going to be working our way through the FIFAs. We are starting on 16 and working our way all the way to 21, doing a different retro squad builder showdown every week. We're kicking it off with Jack 54 HD, someone who's been doing squad builder showdown since day one. And we're doing it, Jack. On Barcelona Neymar. Prime Neymar. Prime Neymar. Absolutely. I know there's high rated cut versions of him now, 91, but five star, five star. This was just like the OG of sick Neymar cards. I suppose there's there's the good ones at Santos as well, wasn't there? They were like and informs that went in like yeah. FIFA 12 and stuff like that. Yeah. Which Neymar have you got actually? I should ask you because there's two normal Neymars on this game. I have got that 88 one. Me too. Okay, that's good. Me too. But he does apparently have an upgraded 90 rated. I've seen these actually, and some players have position changes. I've got a Cam Di Maria and a right wing Di Maria. Interesting, because I was designing a squad. I've got a left wing Di Maria. Excuse me? Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah, I've got left wing normal 86 gold? rated normal Di Maria. That is bizarre. That is really bizarre. So there's three versions of normal Di Maria. Is it because it was 2016 a Euros year? No, but that wouldn't make... Oh, no, because then there would be the Copper America as well. I was like, was it because of the Euros for Di Maria? What, what but... rating is your Di Maria? 86. Oh, I've got... Yeah, I've got a right wing 86 and an 85 cam. Maybe... I think it might have been international tournament, you know. Potentially. Maybe plays left wing for Argentina, but right wing for PSG, and the 85 was his original card, and he got an upgrade. I don't mm -hmm. know if I'm being honest with you, Jack, but there's a lot of interesting cards to take a look at, and we're going to go through and take a look at some of them and do some Squad Builder Showdown. This is not quite back where Squad Builder Showdown started. That would be in my mum's dining room, playing FIFA 15, but they've turned the FIFA 15 servers off, and this is the oldest FIFA you can get back on, and this is probably going to be the last time we can do FIFA 16 Squad Builder Showdown, Jack, because I imagine when FIFA 23 comes out, they'll turn the 16 servers off like they did with 15 when 22 come out there's still people there's still a small community playing this game though i don't know who you are but fair play to you all right <laughs> there's like 600 players on the market or something like that isn't there there's mad stuff on the market as well i was having a cheeky little look before there's like team of the season Kante's at leicester yeah. there's a team of the season griezmann at yeah. atletico the, yeah, so it was. This this card, this Aaron Ramsey card is from the Euros, isn't it? So that's probably why there's millions of different versions of normal cards. Indeed. I think they brought them out because of international positions. So someone's put an Aaron Ramsey 86. Yeah, there's actually, crazily, still people playing and still people listening to cards. There's a team of the year, Sergio Ramos. Someone's yeah. got for 700k. And, and a 700k Iniesta. team of the year in Iniesta. Maybe it's the same guy. I don't know. We've got a lot to talk about. You were reminiscing about the nostalgia of this game because of the menu music, right? Yeah, we can't yeah. obviously play that in the video because then I'd mm -hmm. get copyright striked. But there's a lot of nostalgia to go through. Shall we, before we do all that, guess some formations? What would you like? Okay, uh, I would like the flat 433, please. Okay. You may have it. I put 4-3-2-1. Ooh, okay. All right. What formation would you like? I'm going to go risky. And it's risky because my club isn't as stacked on this game as I thought it was going to be. I haven't been back through all of them. My 17, 18, 19, 20. Them clubs are ridiculous. And I've got so many special. This one's a little bit... I've got a good squad in mind, but I need my formation, and it's 4-3-3-4. Three, three, four. Ooh, okay. I put down the 4-2-3-1. Obviously, the, the one with the wingers. Um, I was trying to think about, like, OP formations back then, and I swear that was the era of, like... Was that 4-2-3-1 era? I was debating whether I should play 3-5-2. Yeah, oh, that's a very good shout as well, actually. Yeah. But I can't... I wanted... Neymar's the guy we're doing the video on. I wanted to stick him up front. Yeah. I'm not sure as we go through these. So, obviously, next Monday, it will be FIFA 17. I don't know if we'll always have the same marquee player. I guess... The further along into the FIFAs we get, the more likely it is that YouTubers are doing this as like a proper full-time job, really committed mm -hmm. to it, got loads of SBCs, and we might have the same cards still chilling on our account. Back then, I think I still lived with my mum when this game came out, I'm pretty sure. It was, uh, my my office was still in my bedroom, uh, so it's a long time ago. Because I, I started making videos on FIFA 12 at the very, very end, and I know we did FIFA 16 videos in the YouTube house, but I think we moved in in the January. So the start of this game would have been when I was still living with my mum. So I don't think my account is as stacked as it possibly was. Either that or I got banned for having a coin seller. It's that long ago <laughs> and I have yeah. to rebuild my account back up. And I obviously I've got team of the seasons and stuff. Not that I should be giving you tips, but not really anything else. Mm -hmm. So this is, I mean, I'm mean, going to enjoy this. I think Jack, this is very reminiscent. Shall we mm -hmm. jump in? First stage, striker, right wing, Barcelona, Neymar on FIFA 16 Retro Squabble Show. <laughs> Before 
before we carry on, I just wanted to tell you guys about the sponsor of today's video, which is NordVPN, where I've teamed up with them to get you guys a huge discount over at nordvpn.com slash AJ3. A VPN is handy for multiple reasons, such as accessing geolock content. You might be away on holiday and want to watch your TV shows from back home. One click on NordVPN and you can change your location and be back at home. Or you can be really, really cheeky and watch some foreign Netflix because maybe they haven't got the TV shows that you want to watch on your Netflix. Super simple. Just make your device think that you're in a foreign country with one click and the whole world of content is open to you. It's also very good for bandwidth throttle. If you're watching Netflix or Amazon Prime or any streaming service at 6 p.m. when it's peak internet times, some internet service providers will throttle that sort of traffic and not give you your optimum speeds. But if you're using a VPN, they can't see what you're doing and thus they will not throttle you. They've also added a major upgrade to NordVPN called Threat Protection, which will scan the URLs and the websites that you're going on, scan the files that you are downloading to make sure that they're safe, and block web trackers. Most good browsers and good antivirus software will do this sort of stuff, but an extra layer of security can't hurt. So if you want to try it out, it's available on all major devices and all major platforms. There's a link down in the description. Like I said, you can have six devices on one account and that link gets you a banging discount on it and if that's not enough there's a 30 day money back guarantee so it's risk free if you want to try it out after 30 days if you don't like it you can just get your money back so go and try it out nordvpn.com slash aj3 the link is down in the description back to the video <laughs> That was a lot more difficult than I thought it was going to be because it's dead easy to go on the concepts in it and think, oh, okay, Jack's got a Brazilian or he's got a La Liga player. He could go 98 Suarez. He could go 97 Cristiano Ronaldo, 97 Suarez, 96, uh, just Suarez, Ronaldo and Benzema, really. But it's what cards you've got in your club, Jack, is the Indeed. issue. So a lot of options, but none of these are purchasable because, you know, this game is six years old. I'm going to let you kick it off. What players okay. would you like, mate? What have you got chilling in that six-year-old club of yours? I've got a lot of very good gold cards. Yeah, I mean, it's a little bit annoying, but the cards still look pretty sick, to be fair. And plus, you know, this is a game at six years old, so using any of these players is going to be quite fun regardless. Now, I've got an Aguero here, and I've got a Diego Costa. Both I want to use. Both get chemistry, regardless of whether I use them on whatever one I use. We're going to go for a bit of Diego Costa, mate. Okay, interesting. And then on the right wing... Is he wing, in La Liga or is he at Chelsea on FIFA No, he's 16? at Chelsea. Chelsea. And then on the right wing, mm. we're going to be going for a bit of five-star skills. Juan Cuadrado, also at Chelsea. That's a bit of a throwback. As a right winger as well. Mm -hmm. Remember, he used to be like so. He used to be so good on this game. Well, he's a right back now, isn't he? Yeah, indeed. Yeah, he's still been got five star skills. <laughs> pushed further back. Interesting. If you okay. haven't got Aguero down on your whiteboard, I'm going to be really, really quite annoyed. I don't have Aguero down on my oh. whiteboard because obviously Aguero is now at Barcelona on FIFA 22. Anyway, has, has Aguero retired? Yes. He has, hasn't he? But he's got a Barca card on FIFA 22. I'll be honest with you, Jack. For my guesses. I sort of thought of you could go for and then kind of also just flick through my club just to get some ideas. So I have a Gamero. I think it, yeah, it is a man of the match. He's orange, yeah. Kevin Gamero, basically. So I wrote him and then I wrote Gareth Bale because that's just an easy guess. Mm -hmm. Fair play. All right, you can mate. have them both. This Lovely Gamero looks stuff. quite good and I was tempted to use him myself. I oh, mate, there's so many. Look, Bakambu. Do you want to know a mad one that I found? Kim Pembe. Where was he? Now you can't see this, but obviously the people can. He is bronze. 60 rated, and he's from the DRC. Ah. The sweatiest, most disgusting centre-back on FIFA now was a Trump card. I've seen quite a few cards in this game, actually, that have had notable nation changes. It's obviously just where EA have got it wrong or haven't asked a player which country they would like to represent or whatever. Or maybe he did want to represent. He's actually played a game for me as a Trump card or a bronze centre-back that has gone in when I was doing Scorpio the Show and actually on this game. That card is very aesthetically pleasing, actually, isn't it? Other than the stats. <laughs> yeah, yeah, apart from that 53 pace, which has now been ramped up by about 30. What a glow up this man has had. Anyway, enough about that. You could have both of yours. Would you like to know what I want? So we went on a bit it, of a detour there because I got distracted by Kimpembe after guessing Gamero. The other thing Gamero led me to is French strikers that are in my club, Jack. Interesting. I've got two other than ben Gamero. Benzema? Not Benzema, not Loic Remy, 
Remember him? What a Ooh, sweaty, yeah. unreal FIFA card he was. Yeah. Premier League starter I've spots got, for Newcastle. Exactly. He's at Chelsea on this one, actually. The one I've got. But I am choosing between two French team of the seasons, Jack. Gomez. Ben Yedder at Toulouse and Lacazette at Lyon. I'm going to go simply because I feel like we can bring Ben Yedder in later in FIFA as a sweaty little throwback. I'm going to go team of the season, 92 rated Lacazette. Fair play, mate. And I'm going to link him, playing a bit of mind games here, Jack, after telling you that my Di Maria is left wing. You are he a lucky was, man. But I also have the right wing one too. I'll you're go for a, him. You're a lucky man. Uh, I put down Aubameyang and Mkhitaryan, the Dortmund Ooh, duo. Yeah. Okay. Um, funny enough, I was going to put down uh, Ibra and Di Maria just because Ibra was back at PSG. Thought it might have been an interesting one. I mean, a lot of is pairs he? went through my head. It's the classic. Oh, I was going to. Yeah, Ibra's at PSG in this game. I've got Manu Ibra. Have you? Yeah. I've got a lone PSG Ibra. So this must have been the year that he went to... He, this must did be... Go... I mean, maybe I did. Man United Ibrahimovic, scrubble the showdown. And then that's why this card's chilling in my club. Interesting. Must have been. I've got Mane at Southampton. In form, Ooh. right forward. Everton Lukaku in form. Team of the season, Deli Ali at Spurs. Oh, man. I thought that guy was going to be unbelievable. It's a bit of a shame. I mean, I hope he is because out. we really, really need some good players mm. next That's season. That's the thing. Do you reckon he could time. reignite his career? Like, back to what he, it was? Genuinely. Awobi and Pickford saved Everton from relegation. However, the game that actually saved us from relegation, like, got us over the line, was the Palace game. Mm -hmm. And we were losing 2-0, weren't we? And Deli Ali come on and completely changed the game. He was, like, the catalyst to say Pickford and Awobi had put in absolute shifts for, like, the six games before that but in mm -hmm. that game it was Deli Ali that made the difference so I'm yeah. hoping so we need him Calvin just tell. got injured for like at least a month so by the time this video comes out we'll have played Chelsea and probably lost about 6-0 we, we, <laughs> we shall see I'm just nostalgically oh Leighton Baines what a man uh, Hibbert must be on this game Tony Hibbert is on this game, Jack. I was saving that bombshell for when I guess one of your players because he is going straight in your team as a trump card. Likewise, mate. He'll be going straight <laughs> in at right back. What? Oh, my God. I've played three games and only scored two goals. What a legend. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you've probably done like a Tony Hibbert up top or something. Full team so far. Very difficult first guesses. Let's move on to the centimids. I've got two centimids of the camp. Jack has got three centimids. <laughs> Into the midfield we go then, Jack. I will tell you who I want first. And there was actually someone who I really, really wanted and just couldn't work him into my squad. Okay. A massive FIFA throwback. Ramirez. Oh, wow. Yeah. Chelsea Ramirez. What a man. 88 pace centimetre. Was this but a 79 I or 80 red card? He's 80, yeah. Yeah, that was that was unbelievable. I'm sure if I had access to the market and all players and stuff like that, it'd be very easy to get him. I mean, just chucking an icon cam or something like that. But getting the links to him and to Neymar and to Lacazette and all the other players that I want to use, he was kind of the one that had to be sacrificed just from sheer lack of strong links to him and stuff like that in my club. So, sorry, Ramirez. You, you can chill on the bench, mate. You can have a little watch along. What a man. Anyway, strong link to Lacazette, Jack, is going to be Pink Footies Ben Arthur. Very nice. Who it is bought for 112k. Footies used to be on the market. Did they? Oh, no. Uh, they might. I think they might have brought out like a team. Yeah. Yeah. But I swear. I remember going around to Matt HD's flat and packing footies Gareth Bale. That's yeah, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They had a little team, didn't they? Now it's just SPCs. But this was before SPCs. There's no SPCs this year. There's so. no SPCs on FIFA no. 16? No SPCs. There is. Nope. I couldn't find them. Shut up. So oh my god, right. you're right. There's, there's no objectives either. It's like, what, what do we used to do? This is where times were a lot simpler, weren't they? Yeah, it's like COD 4. You picked an attachment to go on your gun. You had a red dot sight, or you had a silencer, <laughs> yeah. or you had an extended mag, and everyone was happy. Now it's like, <laughs> what's the best loadout? I've got 16 yeah. creds to spend, and a silencer costs free, and a red... And it's like, I can't be bothered with that. Free perks and an yeah. attachment, mate. That's all you need. Everything's got so overcomplicated. And oh, can, massively, yeah. It's good, and it brings new things, and it keeps it fresher and stuff, but COD's the one for me where it's like, Super, super obvious where you're like, you're trying to unlock all the different attachments and stuff. You, what did you used to do? You got, it was like, you got 15 kills with it and you unlocked a red dot sight and you had to get yeah. like 10 headshot kills to unlock a silencer. Or something. It's something along the lines of that. I can't mm -hmm. remember exactly what it is, but simple times, Jack. Now there's 4 million different perks, 75,000 <laughs> different kill streak combinations instead of just helicopter, uh, UAV, airstrike, helicopter, 357. So much better. So much more simple. 
I do like SPCs and objectives, so I have to say. Yeah, it's good. It is good. This is when, remember Reeve used to do checklist challenge? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you had to build a squad, but he gave criteria for the squad. We might have Three to kind left of incorporate. Furs. Yeah, exactly. We might have to incorporate something a little bit like that into FIFA 23 because of all of the chemistry rumors and things like that mm -hmm. for Squad Builder Showdown, but I think, I think he invented that, didn't he? And then, I'm not saying EA stole it off him, but the next year, EA were like, give us three French players, 57,000 chemistry, yeah. two rare golds, and that, that was literally checklist challenge as a squad building mm -hmm. video, and then EA yeah. brought out SPCs the year after. Madness. Interesting. Anyway, sorry, I'm getting very distracted by all the nostalgia. I'm really enjoying myself. <laughs> right centre mid, I've got another team of the season, actually, Jack. Lasana Diara. I used to love that guy. I think he had a stint at like Valencia, maybe. Or oh, no, he, did, he was at Real Madrid, wasn't he? He was, was definitely he? at Real Madrid. He was. He was definitely yeah, yeah. at Real Madrid, yeah. What a card. He's like five foot eight or something, isn't he? Yeah. How do you know this bloody El Jack? Mate, I just, I used to love the card on FIFA. It was unreal. It was him or Europa League Krachowiak. Remember him? Yeah, I used to yeah, love Krachowiak. Krachowiak. He was yeah, like yeah. at Sevilla or something like that, wasn't he? Yeah. What a man. But I'll go Lasana Diara for the team of the season. And then finally, on the left-hand side, I've looked at this before. I've planned this ahead. I'm pretty sure he's like 77 rated. Casemiro. Oh, he's 80 rated. Oh, I've got a 77 one. Wow. What? Really? Yeah. I swear he's 80 rated. I literally looked a second ago. Oh, don't say that. Have you just got the dodgy version? Apparently. But can I even have him? Did you worry me the fact that you've just looked a second ago? Yeah, yeah. There's an upgraded Casemiro. Upgraded, yeah. Um... You can have him, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can, can I? Oh, yeah, nice. Of okay. Of course. Can I have them all? Um, well. Well, oh, well, 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 well. Jack. Do you really think you could have got a team with a French striker in it and get away with choosing Ben Arthur? Come on now. Jack, come on. It's come Metro on. Scobble the Show and the people on the, the thing, nostalgia. Like, I'm, I would love you to be able to use this card, but unfortunately he is on my whiteboard, mate. And I did go for a French centre mid as well, but it was... Matweedy for PSG. Oh, I, I was so that tempted. Been... You know, I've got Matweedy in my club. Have you? When you said yeah. French team of season, I was like, oh, come on. But I think he got a footies that year, this year as well. Because he's got a really high rated card. But um, yeah, I've been down Ben Arthur, Matweedy, and Rakitic. I mean, bronzes are like trump cards are going to be a little bit difficult, aren't they, to give unless you have them in your club? I can see who I've got. I Trump cards. <laughs> I had to try to look for a French goalie in yeah. the game. Go on, mate. You can give me. Vincenzini, Cardinale, or Le Nippel, Le Ariola at PSG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whack him in that can, mate. A little bit of the nipple. Very nice, Brilliant. mate. Very nice indeed. Right, do you want to hear who I want for my three central midfielders? First of all, we've got future icon on this game, Iniesta. Is he still on FIFA, isn't he? I can't believe that he's still going. I there was a point where I was making a video and I genuinely thought Iniesta actually already had an icon card. Yeah. And then whoever was filming was like, realise he's got like an inform in the J League or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> this is the thing, when, with Xavi and Iniesta duo, Xavi's card is like fine. It's, 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 it's a decent icon. It's nothing like special. But Iniesta's, Iniesta's card, so good when on he get, gets on the game. it, is going to be absolutely outrageous. He was always the better one, wasn't he? Like on the game. Yeah. He's faster, so he's better yeah. on FIFA. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, so yeah, we've got Iniesta, who I'm pretty sure is going to be coming out of my club. Um, I'm not going to lie. Central centre mid. We have got David Silva. Another Ooh. little throwback. And then on the right-hand side of the central midfielders, we have got... Come on. I couldn't leave out my boy Felipe Coutinho, could I? At Liverpool still? Yeah, yeah, yeah. At Liverpool, Oh, mate. so my head initially was like, ooh, right, Coutinho, Andy. That's a sneaky one Jack will like. He hasn't actually gone to Barca yet, has he, to be nope. the perfect link to Neymar? Okay, fair enough. I put James Rodriguez, because Cuadrado, and then I've got yeah. James in my club. I think he's 87 rated. He is. He is. Very nice card. Thought you might try and get him in. He actually looks quite good. I think he had a Bayern Munich Rakitic card that year as well. For the strong link to yeah. Neymar. But you see that in Iesta, Jack! I knew it. I should have gone for Busquets, man. But it just reminds me of had a bronze there. Yeah, car. He's only got one leg. Oh, literally. This is like the Ben Arthur moment for you. I was well looking forward to using that card. Have you got a Brazilian goalkeeper in, Le in La Liga? 
What Let have you got? Let me have a little look. So... I've got a Diego Alves. If you've got him, that'd be funny. He's a little FIFA legend as well. I've got a Diego Alves, mate. Go on, get him in. What a man. He was Slap so good in. on this game. He was uh, He was uh, the, the go-to goalkeeper, wasn't he, for uh, every single Brazilian side. So you shall not be putting him in goal, Jack, because he's playing centre mid for you. Mmm, fantastic. Okay. Should we keep this moving? Let's do it, mate. Fullbacks. <laughs> Into the fullbacks we go, Jack. And I'm going to go first again because I'm out to hit you with an absolute madness. Go on, mate. The only icon that I have in my FIFA 16 club and thus the one going in this squad is... Gary Neville. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. What do you mean, no, it's not? You haven't written Gary Neville. <laughs> Gary Neville. Gary Neville, mate. I forgot even even I even had an icon card. Carragher had one as well, didn't he, at one point? Yeah, I don't know why I've got it. He hasn't played a game for my club. I bought it for 200k. He's definitely not on my whiteboard, I can assure you of that. That's good. There we are mocking him. He was really good. Yeah. He won yeah. eight Premier League titles, including two as club captain. We are laughing at him, but his card does stink. However, in real life, he was actually I think good. it's because he memes himself a lot, doesn't he? He talks about how bad he was, but... Yeah. No one wants to grow up to be a Gary Neville. Yeah. Yeah. He is. A, <laughs> he, he was a very good player. Yeah. He's going in 57 dribble and he's got... Like, and no, this obviously is my actual club because I've spent all of these coins on all of these players. I clearly just didn't leave it in a particularly good state when I left. No, yeah. And on the left-hand side, I would like a strong link to Casemiro to sort of box that off because then I've got the icon link to do whatever I want to the two centre-backs in goal. So there's two options, Marcelo or Adriano. One's a perfect link to Neymar, one's a perfect link to Casemiro. They're both actually not particularly good. Marcelo doesn't have his five-star skills. He's slow. He is 83 rated, but he doesn't really look that much better than Adriano. So I'm going to bottle it because Adriano's got five-star weak foot. I'm going to pretend that that's my justification, Jack, so I look cool for the video, but actually I'm just a massive bottle job and I'm picking the 79 rated one to hopefully have a fullback because <laughs> Gary Neville's on the other side. Well, by the sound of them two picks, mate, you might as well have no fullbacks whatsoever. <laughs> Um, <laughs> I've basically dirty doubled you, and I haven't guessed any of your players. <laughs> you picked them for me. You can have Jamie Carragher, <laughs> Tony Hibbert, Gary Neville, and Adriano. <laughs> Um, the actual players I put down, ladies and gentlemen, which don't really matter anymore, uh, yeah. was Fabio Quintrao. Ooh. Forgot about really, him, yeah. Yeah, really good card. The perfect link, the OG perfect link to Ronaldo. And yeah. then Van der Veel as well, because I was looking for some PSG right backs. And Van he was there. Veel. Yeah. That was a On throw back and off when you said that yeah. name. Something like sparked in my brain. <laughs> yeah. I think he went, he was one of them players, yeah, that just went around to loads of different clubs. I'm pretty sure he's played for quite a few. I could believe, could be completely wrong there. That could be a load of nonsense, but... But you did know Lasana Diara was 5 foot 8, so I'm going to back you, Jack. This is very true, mate. Fabinho. Liverpool Fabinho. A I right know, back yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that Monaco. as well. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of not right. I, he did play for Ajax, and he did play for Paris Saint-Germain, Fenerbahce, Cagliari, and Toronto. So maybe I'm thinking of someone else. I think I am, but yeah. Either way, I'm the one who looks the stupidest because I've just picked Gary <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Who would you like, Jack? Right, so I've had to swap round Coutinho and David Silva, which I have made you aware of before yeah, any comments. Lost the Iniesta link to David Silva and gained yeah. a Diego Alves link to Coutinho. Yes, so um, I will go for the right back spot first. Funnily enough, there was going to be Danny Alves here. However, I need a strong link. Uh, and so I'm going to go for someone who I'm not actually too sad about using now because I remember back in this FIFA, he was hella OP and very, very good. And we're going to go for a bit of Hector Bellerin, mate. 95 pace. I'm actually so, I was so happy, so excited because Strong Link, David Silva, Kyle Walker, guess your Ooh. player, Hibbert's a right back, in he goes, <laughs> what a time to be up now. Not today, mate, not today. And then left back, I mean, I could put in this Maxwell card that I have in my club. PSG, nice. Yeah, I mean, there's a Felipe Luiz, mate, on the market, it's an inform, it's 35,000 coins. I can purchase this, however, someone has applied a passing attribute to him, which gives him 98 passing. Am I allowed to purchase this? I'll back you, mate, to buy him off the transfer market, <laughs> just because you've actually bought a player in six years later for your team. Are you going to be a snake though and let me buy it and then tell me you've got Felipe Luis down? 
Maybe. I'm going to take the risk. He's in my team. Have you bought it? I have. You see that, Felipe <laughs> Louise, Jack? <laughs> no way. <laughs> Get him the hell out of here. Oh, are you actually serious? I'm serious, yeah. Oh, you are absolute joker. You absolute joker. <laughs> this will never sell ever again. No, <laughs> no one's going to buy that. And now I'm 35 That's the only sale in the last six Poorer. years that's happened on this game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for crying out loud. Oh, what a time to be. Hey, if it makes you feel better, in three months' time, you wouldn't have been able to use them coins anyway because the servers will get to this, this is very true. I don't have any bronze left backs, unfortunately. I've got bronze... At all? No, there's like none. Bronze La Liga left backs is what you're after. Yeah, or like a Valencia left back, I suppose. But they are in La Liga, Jack. I've got one. Do you want them? Uh, yes, give me, give me. Abner, oh, oh. he's... Brazilian and he plays for Rail. Do you a special deal, mate? <laughs> Mates rates. How many coins you got? No comment. Get him in your team, Jack. What a time to be alive. Two sales. You bought two players for your squad. I'm oh. enjoying myself. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. And I hope you're looking forward to next Monday for FIFA 17, FIFA 18, 19, 20, so on and so forth as we work our way towards FIFA 23. But for all that, and before we play a game of FIFA 16, we need to get some centre backs and a goalkeeper. So let's move on. <laughs> The final stage then, Jack, of potentially, probably, the final squad of the showdown ever on FIFA 16. Would you like to go mm -hmm. first or second? I'll go first, mate. I'll get it out of the way. First things first, we're going to whack in an icon here. Gary Neville. <laughs> Fortunately not. Now, I've got Rijkaard or Nesta. Neither need to be used for chemistry reasons. Just to be sweaty. You just... Put them in there to make a mental team. I mean, I don't think either are sweaty, to be fair. I mean, Nesta has 67 pace and that kind oh, of says it all. I guess it's not mate. Maldini or someone like that. No. Was this I before will... Icons? This was before Icons had multiple versions as well, wasn't it? Yes, indeed. Oh, uh, I don't know, actually. But I either way, so. I think I will go for Nesta. And then left centre back, we're going to go for a bit of a FIFA legend in Naldo. Oh, you're kidding. Okay. And then in goal, I've just purchased him off the market. Purchased him off the market. Manuel Neuer. Although I haven't actually purchased him off the market. Let's hope he's still there. But yeah, Neuer, please. <sighs> Fuming. I wrote down two other FIFA legends that are Brazilian centre backs. David Luiz and Miranda. Ooh. I, I wrote I David to... Luiz was the first in my whiteboards without even looking at this game. And I was yeah. torn between writing Miranda or Naldo. See, I had Miranda. a Thiago Silva that I wanted to use, but I thought he was too bait. So I thought okay. I'd go for the FIFA OG. I also put Julio Cesar as the goalie. Oh, okay. I'm very lucky. You can have them all, Jack. I myself am very sorry to inform you that you won't be scoring any goals. I have got the greatest centre-back in FIFA history going into my team. Talk to me. Inform Funes Mori. Excuse me? Do you mean excuse me? Is that one of the players that used to play for Everton? This man's basically got an icon card, mate. I've just sent you a picture of it. What a player. What a clean sheet I'm about to have. I mean, he looks pretty scary, mate, to be fair. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. With that anchor card on, Woo! Jesus. If he's lucky, he might be a couple yards behind Gary Neville when they're running back. <laughs> In goal to get him some chemistry. I've, I've got so, I do feel kind of stupid because I can do literally anything, but Funes Mori's a bit of a Squabbler Showdown OG. For the people watching this video who used to watch Squabbler Showdown back in FIFA 16, they'll know. They are though. I've got like a European Man of the Match thing, Buffon. I've got a Team of the Season Oblak. I've got a Team of the Season Carius. Excuse me? They're words that, that don't really go together, are they? Yeah. <laughs> Petr Cech's normal card from back when he was still in FIFA. There's a lot of options we could have gone for. But I'm going Tim Howard to get a strong link to Funes Mori. And I'm going at centre-back. None of this team of the season are black and then goad in and all that. No. No. I'll have international man of the match, Colaccini. What on earth have you done to your defence? What do you mean? What do you mean? Have Gary you seen Neville, the state Colaccini, of it? Funes Mori and Adriano. You don't think that's the greatest thing to ever exist? Absolutely horrific. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> Horrific. Um, fair play, mate. Honestly, I genuinely think if you gave me free roam to pick whatever defence I gave you, that would still be worse than it. Wow. Horrific. I was pointing at Smalling when you 
We're talking okay, about the greatest yeah, centre-back sure. on FIFA. I was getting very excited indeed. And I also had another contender on there on my whiteboard in Koscielny. Do you remember how OP Koscielny used to be? Okay, sure. And then when you guessed Julio Cesar for me, I also got very excited because uh, he was so good on this game and I put him down. So you can have them all, mate, but I'm sure you're not surprised by that. <laughs> not at all, no. <laughs> I am just looking at like what I could have done differently just out of curiosity. Vincent Company? Yeah, I was trying I mean, to fit him into oh, my team. I, I, I do to... kind of regret not getting Yoyo Torre in, I have to say. Yeah. For the people that, that didn't know, instead of when I had Iniesta here, I was actually wanting to use Patrice Everett left back and then Koulibaly's team of the season Ooh. at left centre back. And then I was going to get Buffon in goal and then right back was going to be Danny Alves and these two would have been swapped around. So that was the original idea, but obviously chemistry had to be uh, changed up. But yeah, still like my team, mate. Still like my team. I'm looking at mine. I could have gone Godin, Inform Masaccio, team of the season, or black. But you know what? I'm happy with... Tim Howard, Inform Funes Mori, and I'm out of the match, Colaccini. So, criticise me all you want, Jack. You're about to lose this team with Nipple Cam, Tim Howard in goal, and Funes Mori at centre back with Adriano and Gary Neville bombing it down the flanks. Things that nobody has said ever. <laughs> Let's get into it again. <laughs> right then, in we go, where you might notice that. Jack has got Rijkaard at centre-back now. That is because he decided to go into a game just now with a green, a full green kit on a green pitch because grass is green and I could barely see his players and you definitely wouldn't be able to see them in the video on mobile. So he quit, changed the kits and on FIFA 16, loans uh. lose games when you're playing friendlies and that was Nesta's last game for Jack's club. Sorry, guys. <laughs> you are stupid. Do apologise. So he's back. He's wearing yellow. <laughs> And hopefully, uh, we'll actually be able to see what's going on this time. Lost. It is L2. Oh, see you, Jack. Oh, hoo, hoo. oh my god. No. Oh my god! <laughs> Shut up now. <laughs> what? <laughs> Holy moly. I'm going Emmanuel Neuer in goal. Okay. Me. Oh my god, I'm gonna get battered. I mean, you have got Coutinho, and I have just scored that goal. Should you just press shoot with him? Got on the side, Diara. Look at this from the nipple. Oh, what a ping. Oh my god, this Lacazette's insane. This oh. is the FIFA where I was absolute dog crap, wasn't it? Get There's me no back way, on FIFA man. 16. What on yeah. earth is this about? Are you having a laugh? Oh my god, this Lacazette's insane. Mate. One touch, bang! Nah, man. <laughs> I'm not having Neymar's this. getting shown up. Not again. Yeah. Funes Murray! What a Shut man! up. <laughs> We're gonna discard your old club, Jack. How has this happened, though? Some of us are just naturally gifted at games, you know? Like, we can go back six years later and just pull it out the bag. Oh, my God. See, this game's not tech. <laughs> this game's, this game, this game's not technical enough for me anymore. Oh, what a save! Oh, he scored anyway. Shut up! You are not having a good time, Jack. You are not having a good time, mate. I mean, sorry, but how does he get up that quick for a rebound? Is that a first half hat trick for Lacazette? This could be. This could be a level nil job here. <laughs> It really could be. It's I a feel good job I've got Ariola, otherwise it would already be. <laughs> no joke, I genuinely feel hopeless at this game. This is funny. Neymar's done literally nothing, by the way. Yeah, I'm, I'm terrible. <laughs> I am terrible at this game. Absolutely. Guys, I'm sorry for the, uh, the horrific performance. Some of us are just built different, Jack, you know? Is that a goal for 77 rated Casemiro? It was. That's a red card, ref. No way. Straight what? red. See you later, Coutinho. Hey, oh, a... we got a goal. Come on. <sighs> Diego Costa. The 11-0 dream has been 
chop down. See, so a nice little bit of build-up play. Funes Mori can do anything. <laughs> Was that a deliberate chip shot or a little no. scuffer? I don't know how I chip shot that, mate. Oh my god, I've put way too much power on that, mate. This lack is that's ridiculous. Uh, oh, leave me alone! There we are. I've gone for mockery rather than discards at this point. <laughs> Here we go. Come on. So all come and flooding back to you. It is. Just took a Little red bit. card to bring back the memories of how you used to play this FIFA. <laughs> I just forgot about all the near post shots you could do. Oh. Oh. No. <gasps> as if, by the way, as if you can get in front of me and I literally can't see. Where I'm kicking my plate. Oh, okay, that's how that one worked. Oh my god, what's he doing? <laughs> Could it be 5-5? Five, five? No. <laughs> Could it be 5-5? Five, five? Oh. 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 Oh my god. <laughs> Never in doubt, mate. Don't you worry. There we go. 5-3. Do you know what, Jack? You actually pulled it back. Fair play. Yeah. You, I mean, you got a red card and your team started actually playing good. I know. I, I, I have no idea how... That you were just finding so that much makes space. Any sense. Coutinho yeah. is holding you back, mate. I think he was, mate. To be fair, every, I don't think Diego Alves made a pass the whole game. Passes... Okay, fair play. He did. 15 out of 17. It felt like he misplaced every single pass. I'm sure that is wrong, to be honest with you. Um, but yeah, I mean, Ariola, wait, he completed the most passes for you. On my team, yeah. Yeah. Mad. Mental. Well, I have really enjoyed myself. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I guess I was thinking, do we give away copies of FIFA 23 for the loser? Do I feel like we should just do it. Like old school squabble the showdown just for the nostalgia. Because yep. you can quick sell players. Indeed. You, oh, yeah, you can. And you can't get them back. Exactly, mate. Oh, God. Here we go, then. Here we go. Mix so the team got? around at your own peril, Jack. It is two discards, isn't it? Yeah. Not that it really matters, but it's just a bit of fun, isn't it? Like, yeah. retro scope the showdown, proper nostalgia job. We'll do the discards like we used to. Here we go. Right. I am ready, mate. Left centre back and right wing. <gasps> You've got Diego Alves. Ooh. And Neymar. Did actually? Oh, that's yeah. kind of funny. <laughs> I mean, he's alone, so <laughs> there's not really much I can do about it, to be honest. Um, and conveniently, he has run out, run out of loan. Of oh, he's run out of contracts here, so he's literally <laughs> useless to you. Nice. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's, yeah. But, um, yeah, that would have been a big discard, mate. That would have been a big discard. I hope you guys they enjoyed this video. Regardless. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, then. That is FIFA 16, Squabble Showdown, probably for the final time. I will see you guys next Monday for FIFA 17.